And what do you think about social media for people that feel disconnected? How are you with social media? I, I love social media, but I think you have to be careful who you're following and what you're reading. You have to understand there's a lot of false things out there. Not everything you're going to read is good or accurate. And you, there's a lot of people on social media that are just there to bother other people. Definitely when you're feeling anxious or depressed, you don't want people attacking you. So social media is good, but you just have to find your right base, your right network. Any more specific suggestions around that? I think that's a great idea that, that you have to be aware of, like who you surround yourself with. Well, like for me, I'm a doctor, so I like to follow, surround myself with a lot of people in healthcare. So I would look to your interest. What are you interested in? Do you have a specific interest like sewing or selling stuff? Try to get people who have similar hobbies or interests with you and start from there. I know. I think that developing a social media, a social network like that is, is an amazing idea. I, mm -hmm. I remember the first person that started talking bad things, negative things to me and blocking them. And I thought, wow, life should be so easy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you Definitely. feel the black like real people or it, I'm joking, but, but it's like you, you really do create the life I think on social media that, that you want, you know, these amazing people are just at the end of your screen and you can see them and see how they're thinking and feeling and how, what they're doing to cope and how they're helping their patients. And you're a leader in that though. You are. No, thank you.